What's up, guys? Uh, Liberates here. So yeah, that's what we're gonna be making, and um, it's a pretty cool effect. So uh, it doesn't take that long either. It's a simple, sexy effect. Okay, so wow, my mouth is too close to the mic. Sorry. Okay, so let's just start. Um, I got my clip here. Actually, I gotta show you what to do first. Okay, so I'll just show you this video and commentate over it. Hold on, Timmy. Okay. Um, I'm sorry mute it so you can hear me my sexy voice okay so basically just on Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 you want to go on terminal and as you can see that's where I am and you're gonna want to come to this wall right here where I'm shooting and it it's basically like a green screen except for in this case it's a blue screen and you want to have like no camo on your gun and you want to set the game modes or the game type to like unlimited score unlimited time and hardcore mode enabled and then basically what you want to do is I want to reload and then have my guy sprinting so I'm gonna shoot my gun in a second to get so I can reload and then you're gonna want to do it into the blue screen to where you can't see anything else except for the gun and so yeah that's what I wanted to do so that's it okay so now what we're gonna do is I'll drag this clip <laughs> this clip into Sony Vegas and the part that I want to be like that gun effect. Um, hold on, let me crop out the edges real quick. <laughs> like a dot. Maintain aspect ratio. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead, zoom in a little bit so you can go frame by frame, and I'm gonna go to where he starts reloading, which is somewhere here, pretty sure. Oh, okay, there he goes, shooting his bullet. And now. Wow. Okay, so I'll start it right there. So uh, I'm gonna split the clip, and then I'm gonna go to when he's done doing whatever I want him to do. And Sony Vegas just froze. Okay, my computer is really slow today for some reason. <laughs> Come on, computer. Okay, so now I'm sprinting into the wall, and I want it to kind of come together. So I'm not gonna go all the way into the scope. I'm gonna go like right there, and I'll split it then grab these yellow markers and go around that region and I will render this out and remember render loop region only and click save and I just got a text ah uh, yes Anthony spelled that wrong okay so now take this and go into after effects <clears throat> and drag it into your project, then uh, drag it down to your timeline. Yeah, I always lose track of time. Okay, three minutes. We're good. This shouldn't take too much longer. <laughs> okay, so now what you want to do is go to, now that it's in your timeline, go to Effect, Keen, Linear, Color Key, right there. Click the first one, and click on the blue screen. Oh, by the way, if you don't, if you want to do this in, like, Call of Duty 4 on broadcast, I think there's a green screen somewhere on that map, and there's a blue screen also. And on any other game you're playing, I don't know, just find a blue wall or a green wall or something, but make sure it doesn't have any like cracks in it because that screws it up. Okay, so now come over to your effects and go to find edges. So just type in find and this should pop up and drag it on. And then what you get is kind of like an inverted sniper. And that already looks kind of cool, but I don't want that. So I'm going to go effect, color correction, uh, CC toner. And then let's say you just want the outline of your gun. So I'm going to change the f the main color the highlights to black and then go midtones and I'm gonna change this to like a blue and then on shadows I'll make it a blue so now you just have the outline of your gun and that looks pretty cool but if you wanna just overall change the appearance of your gun just set the midtones or the highlights and then set all the colors kinda the same around the same so now you can see I just kinda got a blue gun and play through this does the animation it looks pretty cool okay so I'm gonna render this out real quick shouldn't take too long okay my goal is to keep this under like six minutes okay oh, so now we got that and there it is so I'm gonna drag that into Vegas and I'll just put that over there and then I'm gonna split the audio from the video. Actually, no, you don't really need to do that, but you know, whatever. Okay, so I'll delete that and then I'll drag this little doodle in. And now, as you can see, 
Actually, I'll start it from here. And you know what I forgot to do is I forgot to get a second clip where I'm actually shooting. So I don't want to go do that right now because I'm lazy. So basically, just right before the part where you keyframed out, so like right there, you can see him moving his gun up. Then you want to like split the clip on that part and then move it together with this one and so it'll look like it kinda just smoothly transforms from this to the actual gun um... i'm sorry if you don't understand that send me a message i'll redo this tutorial if you guys really want but i'm really lazy tonight because it's sunday and i got school tomorrow and that sucks okay so i'll show this at the end of the video again and yeah thanks for watching